You know, if you really think about it, cars are kind of insane. Like, you bring people back from, I don't know, 300 years back and show them this. This is insanity. But we don't let those intrusive thoughts that keep us awake till 2 a.m. Uh, in our videos, let's get along with calm driving. Here we are stuck in traffic. The, there's a crash ahead somewhere. And everything's not moving except this left lane that's called toll, toll road. Oh, even that stopped. That's perfect. That's perfection. So it probably happened on the on the left side. So they're probably just moving everyone towards the right. That's why they stopped. Because there's no way they should be stopping. Because they paid for that. They paid to go faster, faster than us plebs on the right regular lanes. Look at us with our bright brake lights. We didn't move for a while, so I skipped a little bit. But I wanted to show you all, while everyone is struggling with our hardship of staying in our cars, going two miles per hour, this bus, these one, two, three buses on the right, there's a party going on in there, and as you can hear, my microphone picked it up. Yeah, there, I, I could see, my, the camera didn't pick it up, but there are people dancing, and doing some adult acts that was pretty clear they should have more tent on that window if they don't if they want to do all that stuff in there but I wonder what that bus is about super curious and I pointed the camera at the bus but as you can see you can't see jack shit I think it's better for them and for our minds our feeble minds to see whatever is going on in there it looked pretty fun. It looked more fun than I was having in my alone four-seater, no, five-seater car going two miles per hour, as I just mentioned earlier. I keep, I keep looking at the bus, thinking what it is, how much fun they're having. But we should get back to our daily scheduled traffic jam and even the express lane I, I call it tollway it's not toll it's I think it's called express lane it's just so that the government can make a little bit more money uh, and then people can go a little bit faster but not today not today you paid for nothing you idiots you are stuck with us you are one of us I do my voice over 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 these footages that I shot this is actually oh I'm, I'm looking back at the bus look at that you can't see anything that's good uh, this is actually not that fun to look at I mean why would you want to look at someone being in, stuck in traffic but I guess the point is you gotta stay calm you gotta let thing let things happen this is just part of life things are going well Things are going awesome. At least we're moving forward is what we should be thankful about. Because sometimes at some place, at some place right now, there are people stuck in traffic, not moving a centimeter, a foot, an inch, nothing. They're just stuck there. But look at us. We're slowly, we're slowly with our own pace moving together as a whole group let's speculate let's look at the cars look at this car on the right side it's a business class business car but it's kind of late uh, in the afternoon I don't think he's doing business look at the the UPS truck how many packages you think there is it's Christmas time it's holiday times so probably a lot of gifts uh, not for me not for you, only for cool and lucky people. But I hope they have a good time. Even this car in front of me, I should probably have blocked out his license plate, but that's too much editing. Uh, it's probably uh, a woman driving. 
you know, with the family and hope she's happy. Uh, that car on the right, that Mini Cooper, it's probably a young teen who is enjoying life, has a girlfriend. Unlike me, unlike you, everybody else is happy, only our lives are terrible. That's what people think, but really that's not the case, man. You have to look at things with a better perspective. Think of things that are going good for you. You know, gratitude, journaling, I don't know, some bullshit. Let's cut this out. Being a filmmaker, uh, I try to get a cool shot of my rear view mirror. You can see the express lane going much faster than we are. I think they paid for that. But yeah, uh, next shot. Now we're gonna look at something else. Oh, it's oh uh, yeah, it's the buildings on the side of the road. I cannot read what that says. Probably a shopping, shopping mall center or something. Yeah, cool buildings, cool shots. Everybody's already gone home. Probably all closed. Maybe still open. You never know. You know, one thing about malls and stores in America is one one thing I never really quite liked is that you need a car. You need a car to get to anything. Really. You need a car to go get groceries. You need a car to if you have a cut on your finger and you need a car to get to the nearest 7-Eleven. That's the only store you have available. If you don't have a car, you can bleed out and die and no one cares yeah look at that mini cooper what a cool car i think i don't i don't think i like the color white on a mini cooper i, I think like a red or probably even blue suits it a lot better maybe a different location would make it look better not in this traffic jam that i'm sitting in right now that I was, I should say, as I've already broken the fourth, third wall, something. Oh, look at look at uh, my dashboard. I have enough fuel, enough heat in my engine block. As I said, going two miles an hour. Uh, don't worry, I'm looking up. Uh, I'm not looking at my phone. Or my camera, I should say, to sound more professional. Listening to country music, yes. That's what you do. My car is on drive, yes. And that little orange shows that it's on auto. Because it's not snowing. It's not sandy or muddy. So I don't have those... I don't have a set that... You can just turn the knob. So it goes on snow and it stays on 4x4. I think it does that for sand and mud, but I've never been on those. You know, I try to make my car slip. People are afraid of their car slipping, but I try to make my car slip and it doesn't. It really pisses me off because like, it's fun sometimes. I'm, I'm sorry you can hear my, my hand rumbling and fumbling on the microphone, but that was one hand driving and one hand my videographer filming because that sounds more legal than saying something else that I sh probably shouldn't say on the video and look at that truck I think that truck has gold no what is it I, I couldn't make it out at that time I still can't it's, it's, it's a, something to do with construction maybe you never know so many cool things on the road it has one two three four five six seven eight nine ten tires ten freaking wheels maybe even more I only counted four for that trailer that it's hauling yeah pretty cool life is awesome life is awesome amazing looks like uh i still can't make it out please let me in the comment let me know in the comments 
if you have made it so far in the video I don't know why you're still watching but yeah construction work people lives a little bit later we have a different car in front of us now we got cut off I don't know why it's in this lane I was perfectly fine with the other car in front of me oh look at that car on the right it's a Toyota Corolla or a Honda Civic Honda yes trying to get in my lane is he? I give him I give him some space so he can do what he wants because I am in no hurry to get anywhere because I cannot we're st all stuck he I think he just forgot that he had it on blink 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 you know you got to have your music not so loud so you can hear your indicator go because it's pretty damn loud you can hear it goes bank 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 some some sound like that I don't quite remember well yeah I still focused on this Honda oh it's a Hyundai holy shit you know I used to think those are the same companies quite a while ago but then I looked into it and Hyundai from same parts of the world kind of just like slanted Honda's logo and called said it was their own original I don't know how a lawsuit or something like that didn't, didn't follow because a lot of people I know they think it's the same thing I, I try to see who was driving because as a racist and a sexist that I'm not I don't know where I was going at that never mind uh, yeah look at that red truck that's a red truck all right yep I, I don't know what to talk about at this point it's already 12 minutes into the video but I gotta say something oh it's a Tesla you know Tesla's I just got back from California and uh, Tesla's are really 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 popular there and I was pretty astonished to see all the charging stations they have actual charging stations not just you know uh, a parking lot of a hotel it's all we have in Colorado they have like actual like 20 laid out like a gas station is and then uh, almost all of them had uh, some business that you can sit in and uh, eat some food or just hang out and it was super cheap and our trip was I mean we were kind of cramped in the in Tesla because there were so many of us people every time we got out people were like how the hell did you guys fit in there but it was like we didn't have to pay for gas gas is super expensive in California it was close to like not even close to it was six bucks at some locations and here in Colorado it's around 250 it fluctuates but stays around 250 at least right now it has went up all the way to four dollars but it did come down it did come down oh look we can see the board now it says left two lanes blocked ahead like I said like I said before yeah it's probably in the left lane somebody crashed on those little goofy goobers look at that they have arrows pointing you to go into the other lanes that's pretty cool but no one I wonder how much like how many accidents and what the pro data is on that was with the pro and con I want to see it side by side laid out on a table please and thank you now let me cut a little bit ahead I'm kind of getting kind of bored looking at actually no look at look at those ladders on top of that truck all right just a short while after I felt a little adventurous and I wanted to move over as the sign says to do so so I get behind this truck 
Look at us go. Look at that traffic in front of us. Oh my goodness. You can see a bloody red tail like a like a snake. Like a viper, you know, that's painted red. You know, those are red if you if you paint them. And then but then I realized sitting behind this truck is not the best idea because I'm trying to make a video here I'm trying to film so I gotta get over more I can't just go back to where I came from that is not very adventurous we're gonna take the path path least taken or at for this situation uh, just the right lane not even the right most lane there's so many damn lanes in this highway but no amount of lanes can fix traffic remember that kids if you learn anything from this video you should learn that no amount of lanes will ever fix traffic because the more lanes you add the more people are gonna say oh damn look at all these lanes we can get a car honey and then they buy a car and then it gets added the population increases and there's more cars there's more people more crashes more traffic it never ends it's a never-ending story I mean this is Colorado you should go to Texas to really see that effect it's a uh, it's really depressing the amount of highway lanes they have built over there and it still is terrible to drive but yeah, we got a little bit a better view from from this lane. It was better to get out from behind that truck. No, no offense to the truck. You're just a little too tall for my pleasure. And uh, we still don't see the crash. Like, actually, I can see little blue, blue and red flashing all the way in the distance. I don't know why that car wanted to go to the left, but this lane is moving, so we will be moving. We move forward. Bada bing, bada boom. You know, that's just how it goes. You know, I this video, I was gonna heavily edit it and make it super fun, but this is more calming for my, for myself and, uh, that's all that matters. I, I hope you're enjoying. This is not the best camera work or commentary or visuals, but it's a video. And uh, YouTube lets me upload for free. So I shall. Oh, look at that. As I, I, I just said, it's not the best camera work, but I just proved myself wrong. Look at this new angle. Oh my god, it's a van. Car. It's another car. He's rolling slowly. Good thing you can't see inside. Because uh, I, I don't want other people. His face is to be. Without consent. To be filmed by me. That's not very ladylike. Or gentleman like. Whatever your uh, desire is to be. But uh back to regularly scheduled traffic we still haven't gotten to the crash do you want to get to the crash let me get to the crash hold on now we're pretty close to the crash and i found out why people were not using this lane because this is uh i got into an exit lane and uh yeah it just happened i'm sorry i didn't know maybe i did i, I didn't care because it was moving forward that's all that matters but I'm trying to get over to not take the exit because that is not where I want to go and I'm oh yeah he's just you I don't know where you're gonna save maybe like not even two seconds because you would get there no matter what even if I'm holding you back well good for you buddy and then this is the crash. Let's see. There's one police car. I won't say cop because I respect. And then there's a Mercedes in front of me. And better not hit it. 
two, three. Wow, it's a lot of bright lights. Christmas going on. But where is the crash? What happened? Show me. Show me. Oh, yeah, that's a truck. Oh. Yeah, I'm not sure. I didn't get the... I didn't get a clear picture. I should have pulled over and got on a drone shot of that, but... There was a red truck parked on the very left as well. And that truck we just saw was uh was being put on a trailer so they probably it was probably that truck and that red truck on the very very left that crashed but now we're free we're finally free from traffic we're going the speed limit not a single not a single mile over we're going fast